Welcome to a new episode of Headline Decoded. It's no secret that fintech and digital lending are booming in India and they're about to get a regulatory makeover. Yes, you heard that right. The industry players are working tirelessly to create a self-regulatory organization or SRO in partnership with the RBI. What's their goal? It is to set standards for industry conduct and establish a bridge between sector and regulators. Now let's understand this a little more. The SRO will focus on a code of conduct, business models and infrastructure guiding industry players with essential oversight. The Digital Lenders Association of India and the Fintech Association for Consumer Empowerment are working with the RBI to shape the SRO with final guidelines expected in the next three to six months. The SRO will bring clarity to business models and promote transparency, attracting investments and eliminating non-viable models. Unsustainable or risky models may need to reevaluate or exit the industry as the SRO enforces stronger regulatory standards. Now, SRO marks a significant step towards transparency, credibility, and regulation in the industry with the RBI's support. This move is expected to attract more investments and drive the sector towards sustainable and ethical growth. Stay tuned for more such headline decoding. Don't forget to like, share, and subscribe to our channel. Investments in the securities market are subject to market risk. Read all related documents carefully before investing. This content is purely for information purpose only and in no way to be considered as an advice or recommendation. The securities are quoted as an example and not as a recommendation. 